Hi, in this short video I want to show you how to do a chi-square test for the results of a Likert scale, like the one that we have in today's assignment. So this is a, an Excel spreadsheet that simply has the results of the first question, whether Quest should open a branch office. And these are the Likert scale values and the number of responses. So what I need to do is create some new uh, data. And the first item in the new data is going to be the number of agree responses. So that's going to be agree plus strongly agree. We're going to ignore neutral. So 8 and 8 are 16. So there's 16. Now, the next one will be disagree responses. So there's 2 and 0. So that's 2. OK. Now, how many responses do we have total? Well, we have 8, 16. Skipping neutral, we have 18 responses. So 18 divided by 2 equally means that we would have nine responses here and nine responses here if things were just uh, random. Okay. Now, I can go up to the Formulas tab, open More Functions, Statistical, and under Statistical, you'll see there's a chi-square test. Clicking that, you get a little window. And the window wants you to enter the actual range, which is A7 to 8. So that would be A7 to A8. And the expected range is over here, which is B7 to B8. B7 to B8. Click OK and you get a value of the expectation. Now, this means that uh, the probability of getting these numbers just at random is 0 0.000967, which is really small. You know, you think about 95% uh, probability, well, that would be 0.95. Um, well, this is, you know, 100 times less probable. So this is how you can calculate the chi-square uh, statistic um, for a Likert scale using Excel.